Crisis in Paradise Sri Lanka's economy falters Sri Lanka, an island nation renowned for its natural beauty and rich culture, is grappling with an unprecedented economic crisis. The country faces a severe shortage of foreign exchange reserves, leading to crippling inflation and shortages of essential goods. Fuel, medicine and food have become scarce commodities, plunging millions into hardship. The once thriving research and development sector is now starved for resources. Laboratories struggle to secure essential equipment and materials due to import restrictions. Funding for research projects has dwindled, forcing many scientists to put their work on hold. The dream of pursuing a career in science seems increasingly out of reach for many talented individuals. Will the upcoming presidential election address this crisis and recognize the importance of science and technology in reviving the nation's fortunes? Science and technology, a beacon of hope. Amidst the economic crisis, science and technology emerge as beacons of hope for Sri Lanka. The country has a rich history of innovation and talented scientists. Investing in science and technology can lead to crucial breakthroughs. Sustainable agriculture can enhance food security. Renewable energy can address power shortages. Promises. Promises. What the candidates are saying. Science and technology have emerged as unexpected talking points. One candidate pledges to increase the national R&D budget to 2% of GDP. Another focuses on promoting innovation and entrepreneurship. Critics argue that this might challenge other sectors like healthcare and education. The scientific community is cautiously optimistic. The true test lies in resource allocation and supportive policies. Brain Drain Sri Lanka's Best and Brightest Flea The economic crisis has exacerbated another critical challenge for Sri Lanka's science and technology sector brain drain. Faced with limited opportunities and a bleak economic outlook, many of the country's brightest minds are seeking greener pastures abroad. Universities and research institutions are struggling to retain experienced faculty, while the private sector grapples with a shortage of qualified professionals to drive innovation and growth. The brain drain phenomenon underscores the urgent need to create an environment that attracts and retains talent, providing opportunities for professional growth and a brighter future within Sri Lanka. Competitive salaries, research grants, and access to state-of-the-art facilities are crucial to attract and retain top talent. Equally important is the creation of a supportive ecosystem that values science and technology, fostering collaboration between academia, industry and government. Can promises be kept? Experts weigh in. Presidential candidates' promises on science and technology are met with hope and skepticism. Dr. Amila Jayasinghe welcomes the focus on science but warns against unrealistic targets. Dr. Ranathunga emphasizes the need for private sector investment in R&D. Government funding alone isn't enough. Private sector incentives are crucial. The feasibility of promises depends on political will and action. Section 6. Education and Innovation – Keys to a Brighter Future Investing in education and fostering a culture of innovation are crucial for Sri Lanka to leverage science and technology for its recovery and long-term prosperity. Strengthening STEM – Science, Technology, Engineering and Mathematics Education at all levels is essential. This includes revising curricula to incorporate the latest advancements. 
providing teachers with adequate training and equipping schools with modern laboratories and resources. Fostering critical thinking, problem-solving abilities and digital literacy from a young age is crucial for nurturing a generation of innovators and problem solvers. Beyond traditional education, promoting vocational training and technical skills development is equally important. Encouraging creativity, curiosity and a spirit of inquiry from a young age is essential. By embracing new technologies while preserving traditional knowledge, the country can create a unique niche for itself in the global arena. Section 7. The need for investment funding Sri Lanka's future. Realising the full potential of science and technology in Sri Lanka requires significant and sustained investment. Increasing the national research and development budget, as promised by some candidates, is a crucial first step. This needs to be accompanied by a transparent and accountable mechanism for allocating and utilising these funds. Prioritising research areas aligned with national development goals, such as sustainable agriculture, renewable energy and healthcare, is essential. Investing in modern research infrastructure is equally important. Creating a conducive environment for research requires not just physical infrastructure, but also supportive policies and a culture that values scientific inquiry. Attracting foreign direct investment in technology-driven sectors can provide a much-needed boost. Investing in science and technology is not merely an expenditure, but rather an investment in Sri Lanka's future. Section 8. International Collaboration Seeking Partnerships for Progress In an increasingly interconnected world, international collaboration plays a crucial role in advancing science and technology. For Sri Lanka, forging partnerships with other nations and institutions can accelerate its progress and help overcome the challenges it faces. Partnering with countries that have made significant strides in science and technology